Radio Raheem here with Richard Abril. You're fighting Brandon Rios this Saturday. Now, no one thought that it was going to be you in the ring against Brandon just a month or so ago. Talk to me about how you ended up getting this fight. Vas a pelear con Brandon Rio. No, nadie sabía que vos ibas a pelear con Brandon Rio. ¿Cómo viniste a hacer que vas a pelear con él? Bueno, esto para mí es una gran oportunidad. This so, is a very good opportunity. Y me preparé lo más bien posible que, 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 que pude hacerlo. I prepare myself the best I can. So, estoy listo para pelear con Brandon Rio y vencerle en el cuadrilátero. I'm ready to fight Brandon Rio in the ring. Well, when I said how you got the fight, you showed up at a press conference and uh, hit Brandon Rios in the face and that team to make the fight. Talk to me about, was that your strategy? Did that just happen at the time? Was that a, a moment thing or is that something you plan to do? Cuando fuiste a la pelea, a la conferencia de prensa en Miami, eh, que llegaste para, para pelear con él, ¿cómo es que vos estás metido en la pelea? Porque te, porque te lo mereces, porque te, explica cómo fue. Sí, yo fui a la conferencia para que Brandon Ríos y la Torre Ram me conociera como campeón mandatorio para que se, sepan quién es Richard Abril, que por derecho yo tenía que discutirle esta, este título mundial. Ok, at that time I, I, I went to the press conference because I'm the uh, cha interim champion, uh, I have the interim champion, so Top Run didn't know about me, they were uh, announcing the fight with, between Gamboa and the uh, Rio as a champion, so I went there to let them know that the champion, it, it was him, you know, so, uh, but then when uh, he went to talk to him, I don't know, you got, vos viniste a pelear con él, ¿qué fue lo que pasó cuando lo empujaste? No, yo vine a decirle que yo soy Richard Rick, que, que tiene que pelear con él, soy yo, y no sé, él, él empezó a hablar bobería y a hablar cerca de mí, que es cosa que no me gusta. Oh, he went to him and said, you have to fight with me. So um, then Rio started talking about, uh, you know, nasty thing, and then he didn't like it, and he pushed it. Now listen, you are the interim champion, but you would admit that Brandon Rios is probably the toughest fighter you've ever had to face. What are you doing in the gym to prepare to step up to another tier of competition? Vos sabes que eh, vos sos el interino, pero Brandon Rio es un boxeador fuerte. ¿Qué es lo que ha hecho en el ring para en tu entrenamiento para para pelear con este? Bueno, ese plan táctico lo tenemos yo y mi entrenador, que lo ejecutaremos el día 14 de abril, ahora el sábado que viene, y ahí verán El plan táctico que tenemos contra Ríos. Okay, now I prepare myself, but I'm going to tell you uh, on on the 14, you people are going to see what I prepare for Ríos. Now I talked to Ríos a couple of days ago. We may not have to wait till the 14th. He's pretty upset that you hit him in the face at the first press conference. Are you prepared if he attacks you today? Él él dice que habló con con Brandon Ríos y él está bien enojado porque le diste en la cara. ¿Qué crees que va a pasar hoy? Bueno, yo voy a estar a la viva. Si yo voy a estar a la viva, yo no, yo voy a hablar con él, yo voy a hablar normal, voy a decir lo que tengo que decir aquí. Si él quiere problema, pues hay problema. He said that he's going to be here as a normal person. He came here for, for a press conference. He's not intent to do anything bad, but you know, what comes is going to be. Is there bad blood between you and Brandon when you get in that ring? Uh, is it? I mean, you're always competing, but is there something personal about this fight? Hay algo personal en, entre vos y Brandon que vaya a estar en las peleas. Tienes algo contra él o él? No, solamente yo vine a hacer mi trabajo y a uh, y a ganar la la correa que es lo que yo quiero. No, not really. I just came here to uh, win the title and get the belt. And last question, this is the biggest spotlight you've ever been in as well. A win tonight, or a win on Saturday, could bring your name to the world. You would be instantly a famous guy in boxing, whereas right now you're not very well known. How are you dealing with that pressure? And on the night, are you worried at all about the bright lights and the, all the press attention? ¿Cómo te sientes que ahora que vas a pelear con Brando, vas a, hacer la, eh, vas a tener mucha presión? Eh, sobre tu sobre tu espalda en, en ver quién es Richard Abril estás preocupado en eso no al contrario yo no tengo nada que perder esta pelea Richard Abril surgió de la nada o so, el que tiene que estar preocupado es él porque si pierde con Richard Abril dónde irá Brandon Ríos si al contrario Richard Abril gana Richard Abril se, hará, se le abren muchas puertas contrary I have I came here as a uh, Richard Abril I have nothing to lose uh, I'm here to win if I win it's going to be a lot of uh, door opening for me and Brandon you know they they know him very well so if he lost you know that's bad for him 
you're not known as a heavy puncher. You're not known as a knockout artist. You're, you're more known of a, as a defensive fighter. To win this fight, you're going to have to be more aggressive. Are you prepared to do that? Are you looking for a knockout this time? Are we going to see some action from you? Eso bien conocido en que no sos noqueador ni ni bien duro en en dar golpe. ¿Cómo estás preparado para esta ganarle él? Yo estoy preparado para esta pelea para ejecutar mis 12 rounds. So, si viene el nacado, el nacado es por infracciones de segundo con con el golpeo de la rapidez mía y la velocidad del entrar. Okay. He said that he's coming here to prepare for the 12 round. You know, and that in the pen, if he's coming over, he's gonna, you know, it's it's incredible uh, to say who's gonna, uh, how I'm gonna knock him out, if I'm gonna knock him out. It depends. You know, he's coming, and I'm and I'm fast. Now, everybody wanted to see Brandon Rios and Yuri Gamboa. They're not gonna see that, but they still have to pay to see the fight. Talk to the fans directly. Tell them why they should put their money down to see Richard Abreu and Brandon Rios. Bueno, ya como he dicho, esto para mí es una gran oportunidad y voy a dar el todo por el todo. Voy a demostrarle al público y voy a dar el show lo mejor de mí. Voy a, a, a satisfacerle ese día la plebe completa. El público se va a levantar porque eso para mí es una gran pelea. Ok, this is a, a great fight for me. I'm going to uh, let the people know who's uh, Richard Abril. I'm going to do my best for, for them to... to um, uh, see a good fight, and you know, from then they're gonna see who's gonna re you're gonna be Richard Abreu because now they don't know him. Good luck, Richard. I'll see you on Saturday at the Mandalay Bay. Richard Abreu is facing Brandon Rios.